Hey everybody, welcome back. I uh, just want to show you, I am in the middle of doing so many things today. I've been really, really busy. Um, it's like I've got 10 different projects going. So i um, got to use this time at home uh, while I can and get everything done that I want to get done. Um, so I have cabbage cut. Um, this is going to be for my sauerkraut. And this is what I'm dehydrating. Okay, so it's just the leftover cut cabbage on my tray. Um, it's on my Excalibur tray and with a one of the mats on there. Um, so nothing falls through. Some of these pieces are little and when they, cabbage really, really shrinks when it um, is dehydrated. So um, when it gets done, some of the little pieces fall through the, the grates on this. And um, we don't want that to happen, so I put a mat down. So I'm going to put this in with the onions. Um, it's going to go right into the dehydrator with the onions right now. This is the only tray that I'm doing today. I'm going to wait until the, um, the rest of the onions are done in the morning, and then I'll put a couple more trays of cabbage in there. Um, oh, I was going to get you one of my jars of cabbage. I'll show you what it looks like um, done, but I will do that in tomorrow's video. Um, so I will show you the results of the dehydrated cabbage. You don't need to cook it first. All you do is dry it on um, after cutting. It has a lot of moisture in it. Cabbage, um, I use a lot of cabbage in soups, um, especially cabbage soup with some Italian sausage and um, tomatoes and a beef broth or beef stock. I'm actually making a, um, a vegetable stock right now and I'm, you'll see the video on that pretty soon. So I'm gonna get this in there um, and I'm gonna do a whole video on how to use all of your dehydrated foods because it's great to dehydrate but if you don't use them then you've wasted a lot of time, energy, and money. So you want to, um, you want to know how to you know what to do with them all so and believe me you, once you start using dehydrated foods you'll find lots of uses for them and really enjoy it it's really fun so i'm um, gonna go for now and um let's see if i can maybe show you the oh it's not very light over there i'm just gonna show you the onions let's see the onions are drying they'll be done Probably a little bit later. Yeah, the cabbage is just going to go on a rack in between those. This is a 10 rack Excalibur. A 10 tray Excalibur. Oops. There we go. Okay. So, <clears throat> I will see you guys soon. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions or you want any demonstrations of something, please let me know. Thanks for watching.